What is going on, everybody? We are back with another episode today of Temtem. Uh, we're going to run down to Louis Souvenirs and just peek our head in. This video might be a little bit on the shorter side than what we're used to. Um, might be a, a hair under that 20 minutes, typically. This is not where I thought I was. We're looking for this place. I believe. Hello. Oh my god, you have nothing here, dude. It's Louis, who would have guessed? Welcome to my shop. Would you like a postcard or an authentic ceramic plate? Yes. Mm, I see. You do look familiar. Oh, wait. I know you. You're Anus Kid, right? My, how you've grown. Last time she brought you to my shop, you were a little bawling baby. Probably don't remember, eh? And now look at you, an apprentice. Incredible. Uh, I am here for a Tomessence vial. Here it is. No serious tamer would ever go without Tomessence. It's potent stuff, and it comes in tiny vials. One dose is enough to heal your host squad, but hey, I'd hate to charge a family friend. So let's do something else instead. I'll give you for, for free if you're serious about coming a tamer. How do I prove that? If you come from Zadar, you must have caught some wild Temtem on the way. That's the minimum I'd expect. Bring me any Temtem from the Pristine Coast. Any apprentice worth their name should be able to. I'll be back. I do want to ask you about... I cannot ask you about the surfboard. But we'll be back. Anyways, we're now at the Persane Coast. Where I'll quickly be picking up a Tem. It's gonna be... Uh, we'll take, I'll take a side path for now. No guarantee it stays on the team all that long, but... Um, I'm gonna take the level 6, obviously. So let's take out the level 5 one. And it's, is it water? No, I can't remember. I'm like, I'm pretty sure it's water. So I'll tell you what, let's go ahead and use... Let's use Kick and Shrill Voice and hope it just doesn't kill. Should be perfect. And the Shrill Voice, I'm hoping it'll do like two-thirds of its HP. It did not do two-thirds. Okay, but he overexerted, so we have to we have to catch it before it kills itself. Um, choose this Tem card. Uh, less experience you'll gain. I'm sorry, what? The more difference in level between you and the Tem Tem, the less experience you'll gain from the battle. Obviously, unless it's a higher level. It's better to have a balanced team and increase experience gain. Experience will be lower against untamed Tem Tem. Best way to gain is by battling every NPC tamer around. Cool, you took me out of my... I'm sorry, did I waste a temp card somehow or something? Anyways, we caught the side pad, so. Um, number 69, oh baby. It's a male side pad. I mean, it's got decent stats. Uh, it's got amphibian. After being attacked with a water type technique, it gets increased special attack. Special... I'm sorry. Hold on. First, let's name it. Um, this is... Um, everything coming through the mind is, is stupid right now. I don't know what to name any of these things. Let's name him... Um, I keep wanting to name him like Pokemon names. <laughs> I don't understand why. This is Paladin. Not Paladon, that's a different thing. Uh, Paladin, welcome to the team, Paladin. Increased uh, special defense and attack. Perfect. Alright, uh, welcome to the squad. Probably could use a little bit of XP, but... Tell you what, let's... Um... I'm sorry, I can equip gear? I don't know even what that means. And do you... Are you going to fight me? Let's just do this for now. You are not going to fight me? I love boats. Want to fight? Just on break. Who's your sister? See you around. Okay, well, let's get our Temessence vial. I have a Psypat. That's my favorite one. Very well. I think I certainly have. You have what it takes to be a good tamer. Here is a Temessence vial. It's very powerful. But don't worry. You can refill it at a hill tem machine anywhere at any temporium. And then some people should have their own supply of Temessence. 
All right, so we have one file. I don't... I, as far as I'm aware, the way it works... So, like, if you go in, we can go backpack, vial. Everyone's fully healed. It's now empty. And then if we were to take it over to the... You know, cool shop area here. We can just pop it in here. I don't. Does it show the icon? It does not. Oh, it does, actually. You put the Temescence file right there. And it gets healed up, and now I can use that again at any point along the adventure. So it makes uh, it just makes healing and staying relevant a little bit easier. This dude has one of the legendaries already. I'm going to just see what else is in the grass here. It's just the terrors. But I do want to get Saipat a couple levels. Swapping Tem, understood. So you have a Water Blade and a Rage. Red Mist that uh, makes a Tem Tem brutal, but careless. And then you have Martial Strike. I mean, I'll Water Blade, but I won't be able to attack ever again. Interesting. Um, okay, so you are going to... I guess you're going to Marshall Strike this one. Oh, and actually, you have <coughs> access to Marshall Strike, so... Hurts a lot. Please kill. Perfect. Awesome XP. And actually, you know what? Um, let's Tail Strike. And you will not attack. It did kill, which is awesome. Exactly what we wanted. Paladin's gonna get levels. Uh, it could take a little while to get them leveled properly, but... I am somewhat interested to see what else is maybe up here. Just to scale in a Tetario again. I mean, I think this is what I'm going to run into for the next, uh, you know, two hours in this game. Kind of unfortunate, but uh, let's knock out the scale first if possible. Probably not going to be enough. It's unfortunate. I could lose someone here. Um, let's go ahead and swap you for Kellogg. And then, yeah, you can use Martial Strike and kill the scale. Perfect. And you actually can use Shrill Voice, which is fantastic, and you will not attack. We knew it wouldn't kill, but... Um, we can Windblade here, and then we can do Martial Strike. It's gonna kill, so we're fine, yeah. Okay. Yes, I understand. I understand how the file works. It's not my first day at the Rodeo. So what is he? He's seven. Let's get him to nine or ten at least. And if we run into something really exciting, maybe we'll catch it, but... Just means I'll be doing more of this, you know? I don't really love how much Stam uh, Water Blade consumes. You know? Okay. Okay, I know exactly where I am right now. I remember this, but the, that whole beginning portion, I don't really remember 
doing that walk. Just the Tataru. Flag. What's the damage difference here? I mean, I guess we should probably always be using Sand Splatter if possible. You are a tanky bitch, aren't you? Don't care, didn't ask, plus you're dead. Perfect. Something new, please? Still a Tataru. I think Tataru does give a bit more XP than uh, some of the other Thames, so I mean, it's, it's not the worst fate in the world, but it does feel like it takes forever to kill one. It's getting close to where we can kill a level 5 Tataru. Adios. Perfect. Oh, what are you? Hello. You're cool. Um, let's go ahead and just swap you two. And give uh give two eyes some experience. Okay, give two eye no experience because all of the Thames are dead. Actually took forever. Just for it to be another Tataru. Maybe, I was gonna say, maybe the possibility of actually killing shit in uh, first turn is possible now, and it looks like it is. It's awesome. Got no XP from it, even better. Okay, double battle is a little nicer. Let's try and hit the big one. Level six, the big one. Perfect. I'm really just looking for you to hit level 10, that's all. Nothing crazy. Seems like we got some good stuff going on now, though. I mean, it's the, the kills are coming. Hopefully one more battle. That was quick. That was nice. A double to terror seems pretty much perfect for what we're looking for right now. Uh, it just doesn't matter which one we hit. All of this grinding, we've taken nearly no damage. Couple nibbles here and there, but... I guess we'll take stare. It'll probably never be used. Mm, you know what? I think he's gonna live. He did not. Okay, perfect. Fantastic. All right, so let's go heal, and we will run over to the Academia real quick and see what's going on. How's that sound? Everyone should be happy and healthy. Hello. Welcome to the Academia. Shouldn't you be heading to your next class? Oh yeah, sorry, let me just go to my class that I definitely know about. Not again, what's the matter? This damn thing, he said damn. Can't get it open, but eh. I'm Josep. Josep? Can't get your locker? Forgot the combination again. Any clues? You see, they give you a slip of paper with the number on it, but I have no idea what I've done with it. Maybe they can give me another copy. I'll take care of it. Thanks, you're a real friend. You're a fucking dumbass.
Incredible. Well, I can't give you a copy because we don't have one. We have to comply with uh, Riverine Fellowship data protection policies. You see, maybe you can find the paper. You must have left it somewhere. What's up? Receptionist says, I can't give you a copy of your combination. We need to find this little paper. Where have you been today? Let me think. So I got up, had breakfast, went to the Temporium to get us some spare Tem cards, and then came straight to Academia because I was running late. It's not there. Must be at the Temporium. I'm gonna go to the Temporium and take a fucking look around. Yo, hopefully he gives me like a billion pan suns and I can just retire. Oh, I'm sorry, it's over here. Hello. <laughs> you mean like one of those little slips with your combination for your locker? Yep. You mean like this one? It's Joseph's? Ah, uh, figures. Do me a little favor in exchange. Thanks. No problem. <laughs> Alright, see ya. Never talking to you again. I went to the wrong place. I also never got the surfboard. Here you go. Got it, it's one, two, three, four. No wonder I couldn't guess it. Okay, let's try. Yep, it opened, you saved my life. Here's my lunch, thank you. I was starving, I'll have the sandwich. You take the apple, I don't like fruit anyways. Got two vital apples. 25% HP. Could be worse. And now, before we go anywhere, There was nothing down here. Am I crazy? I was going to say, I knew I saw a thing. Can I go inside, please? What have I done wrong? Uh, have you seen my Pig Epic plushie? Do you like it? Where did you get it? My dad got it for me. It's from Crema. I see what you did there. Cool one. Yay. I would love to see a real pig epic. Can you bring me a pig epic? Sure, I'll find you one. Ain't no chance I'm finding you a pig epic just for you, lady. Ooh, hold on. Give me one moment. I got a message from Skittles about playing some Warzone. How long till Warzone as I am playing Temtem if you've heard of it, send message. All right. We'll see. Um, I can't actually go back there. Right? Like, what? it says, like, there's a quest completion there, but I don't have the thing, so. I don't believe the truth in that. All right. Is this the class I'm supposed to be at? Did I miss it? Headmistress Dolka. What brings you here? Is this my classroom? It is not. I'm a headmistress and this is my office and I'm terribly busy. Is there any reason you should be here at all? Anything I can help you with? You help me. You should be studying my young ward. Actually, there is something you can do for me. Do you know Yusef or Roger, the classmates of yours? Not, not even a little. They're nowhere to be found and they have been missing class every day. Like you, but admittedly, I'm starting to get a bit concerned. Could you see if you could find them? Any clues? Roger was excited about getting a surfboard as a birthday present. Where did you see them last? All right, I'll find them. Very well. Please keep it discreet. We absolutely do not want to involve Carlos and make it official. Who the fuck are any of these people, dude? You can't just hit me with a bunch of new names of people I've never heard of and be like, can you find them? But yeah, I'll find them. That's fine. <laughs> Come back when you found them. I'll make sure you get the best marks. That's fucking illegal. You cannot do that. Hello. Next time, be more punctual. We're almost finished with today's class. Almost finished, motherfucker. There's no one here. All right, anyways. Need to study on my own. Fat chance. All right, well, let's run over to the surfboard man. Now, see if not only I can pick up a surfboard, but see if maybe he's got some clues about that guy. Be careful. Do you have surfboards? I'm sorry, I sold the last one yesterday. It was a very cool, bright board. Cool board. Where did I get the word bright? 
Sophia brought it. I'm supposed to get more stuff next week if you don't mind waiting. Thanks. See you later. Well, that dude got his surfboard, uh, but I couldn't ask that guy, did you sell this dude a surfboard? But no, because I think maybe his dad got it for him. Or maybe that's to pick up a girl. I can't fucking remember. Who are any of these people? Hey, who are you? Wonderful day for swimming. Uh, I prefer surfing. You need a surfboard. All right. Who are you? Hello there. How have you come to contemplate the quasi oceanic? I have actually. It's a shared passion then. I salute you, my fellow oceanophile. Nice meeting you. Just oceanographer. Yes, yes. Nice to meet you too. Please don't distract me. So what do you do? He's studying the river and the topography of submarine ridges and deeps, the ebb and flow of the tides, the Dennis wide effect of the streams and currents. You are a fucking weirdo. Tell me about Solaro though. All right, that's enough. I don't actually give a shit. I have to go. You're annoying and weird. Let's, I mean, I guess we can go check the pier up here real quick and see if he's like chilling here. Oh, no, the pier is huge. I, what mistake have I made? Hello, who the fuck are you? Theodora? Been saying that for ages. No, but I can investigate. Would you? Hey, could you let me know uh, when the fucking ship is coming? Holy shit. Who are you? Are you the person I need? Of course not. Well, I'm at landlubber. It's landlubber? Dude, I always thought it was a land lover because they loved the land and didn't like the ships. Looking for a ship. Haha, <laughs> don't we all? I don't think that's how you reply to that, but that's okay. What about the Turquesa Ferry? It's a fine ship it used to be, but ancient. Reckon it should have spent some time on the dry dock years ago at the hands of a capable shipwright. Keel just kept running away. Holy shit. There's actually so much dialogue. Tell me about yourself. Okay, well, I gotta go then if you're not gonna give me anything interesting. I'm pretty stoked I walked out here just to not encounter the dude I was looking for. But hey, them's the breaks, right? Remember when I said this would be like a 16 to 17 minute video and I have no intention of stopping at 23? And no one was surprised. I do love the fact that there's like all these little quests here. Let's go in here and see. Oh, you're a pig epic girl. I don't have a pig epic. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll think about it. I I will say my, my biggest gripe so far with the game, and this is my new, but I am the kind of person that looks for exclamation points for new things to do and question marks for things I'm done with. And uh, it appears to me that the question marks are just, you can turn it in here if you've met the conditions. Dude, I wish I had a surfboard. I've been saving up all spring, and they said they're sold out. Damn Taurus. Where would you go? Okay, well, great luck. Um, tell you what, those dudes surfing, not here, so. That's gonna do it. Um, Alright, well, before I get too far into anything... Hi, I'm Six Dice. I'm Zara. My friend Max. None other than Sophia taking you to your own town, you must be friends with people in high places. What do you mean? <laughs> You're not just some city slicker. Oh, you must be some big city slicker. <laughs> Professor Constantinos is my buddy. We're friends. Never heard of him. Never been out of Dennis, so most foreigners in this town are just here for the beaches anyways. Must be a big deal if he hangs out with Sophia. See you in class? Alright, who the fuck are you? All these people, like, go to school, dude. What else are you doing? Alright, well, that's actually gonna do it for this episode. The next time we come back, I guess we're just gonna continue going north and go from there. So, that's gonna do it. Hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.